During the pandemic, we were told to stay at home, but now doctors want to send a much different message and they say lives could depend on it. CBS 58's Bill Walsh has the story of a survivor whose quick action helped her beat cancer. Last September, Cheryl Andrews was scheduled for a mammogram, but this was before the vaccine, a time of lockdowns. I maybe had a brief moment of hesitation thinking, oh, maybe it's an excuse not to go. Cheryl did go and doctors found something wrong, so they did a biopsy. I got the results a few days later and it was cancer. For many people, a cancer diagnosis, their worst nightmare, but in Cheryl's case, it was treatable. Because they caught it early and did surgery right away, I'm fine. Cheryl's oncologist at Aurora Cancer Care, Dr. Joseph Weber, says there is a lesson here. Patients are able to come back to regular screening mammograms. But not everybody is getting that message. A survey from August of last year showed as many as 80% of women were delaying mammograms because of the pandemic. And now with the Delta variant spreading, doctors are again seeing patients put off care. The fear is out there. Dr. Joshua Liberman, a preventive cardiologist for Ascension, Wisconsin. But we're starting to see more requests for televisits again. He says televisits are mostly a good thing and they're not going away, but they cannot replace in-person checkups. So I can't listen to their hearts and lungs and, and uh, you know, or, or check to see if there's swelling in their ankles. Both doctors say that while the medical system was stressed at the start of the pandemic, right now your doctor's office or your local hospital is safe from COVID-19 with doing all of our um, enhanced protocols, uh, we're making sure that the patient safety is obviously first and foremost. So there is no excuse to delay a doctor's visit, especially if you're vaccinated. We're seeing the end results of, of people delaying their care. We're seeing they're coming in much worse, uh, in much worse shape, I mean, uh, much more critically ill. Cheryl Andrews has recovered from her surgery. She says one good decision, getting preventive care on time played a major part in her being cancer free. So if I had waited a few months, um, there's a chance it could have spread um, outside the margins and then I would have had chemo or radiation. Dr. Weber says there has been advances in mammograms over the past few years. The latest 3D mammograms see better into the tissue and as a result, they reduce callbacks. Reporting in Grafton, Bill Walsh, CBS 58 News.